is back. I never knew brown was this fast. I mean, imagine if brown was as fast as orange. There has been a new update to Rainbow Friends Roleplay. So over here towards this area, there is a new morph. It's the brown fan made. This is how brown would look like as a fan made version. Look at us. We are two little windmills. Oh, yeah, it reminds me of a windmill. That's what it is. It also kind of looks like a fork. I don't know why, but it feels like it looks like a spork. Oh, not a fork. What am I saying? A flower. How did I mess those two things up? Okay, a flower, because obviously the middle part and all the little brown parts to the edges of his head are the little petals. I mean, this is just a phenomenally well-made skin. I don't know how it would work, though. Like, what would the actual morph be how would it you you know how would it use its body type to attack other players and how and how he will affect the overall gameplay of rainbow friends if he's added you could hold shift to sprint really oh i had shift lock on so let's see that oh <gasps> you can oh my goodness i never knew brown was this fast i mean imagine if brown was as fast as orange that would definitely be crazy i mean <laughs> Brown being the same speed as orange, there has to be some kind of setback to Brown though. Maybe his one eye makes him see things very differently. And look, here is orange compared to brown. I want to see the height difference of the two. Orange, stop running away from me. Orange, where are you going? All right, let's go over here and compare the height difference between the two. Can you please stand still, please, orange, please? Look at the height difference. I'm literally almost three times taller than orange. Brown is just such a tall morph. I'm pretty sure he's also taller than green and blue so let's head over this area and compare their height from here all right let's see oh yeah he is way taller however <laughs> i mean no one could beat the height of this purple man look how tall he is what <laughs> we are literally skyscrapers in new york city we're just towering over everybody and look at pink over here i mean pink is just decent height right he's just average size his height just reaches the same size of brown's neck i feel like the only reason brown's neck is so long is because it's very thin moving on we're gonna be playing the new update in rainbow friends concept and obviously the new morph is over here maroon and maroon is a different shade of red that's why he has this reddish color and look how smooth this walking animation is i mean the wings flap as a you know levitates through the ground and once he stands still his wings are still flapping just so he could stay afloat and oh my goodness you see this head right now this is one of the flying rainbow friends. As I said before, these rainbow friends can be a uh, flying or water-like or water-type rainbow friends. So they could thrive in water or they could thrive in the skies. Obviously, this maroon character thrives in the air due to his wings. Oh my goodness. Oh, I had to turn on the sound because if we don't have the sound, we cannot hear how the jump scare sounds like. And the horns is just humongous the teeth is also really really sharp and very even too whoa it sounds like a literal dragon like godzilla that's what it sounds like godzilla when he's shooting his energy beam oh that is so creepy however maroon has a really similar jump scare to vile ventilation or purple we're also going to showcase all the other skins for those guys who have never watched a video of rainbow friends concepts or don't even know rainbow Friends concepts as a game so we're gonna go check out purple before we go check out all the other skins i mean i want to compare the two ju uh, jump scare animations so i'm pretty sure my brother's in the server and he's using maroon let's head over to the new village area and oh actually no let's head over here and compare the jump scare so stand still stand still and do your jump scare maroon all right so that's the jump scare for maroon and this is the jump scare for purple it is very very similar obviously the jump scare sounds are different 
However, they both have that chomping animation and the arm movements when they jump scare. But if I had to rank either one of them, I have to rank Maroon because Maroon is just such a cool looking morph and the jump scare that goes with it is just phenomenal. Let's go check out Yellow now. Yellow is definitely the tallest concept morph out of them all. Kind of like a giraffe. His neck is so long that it's just tilting down. It's just sagging. So here is the jump scare. I mean, this is definitely one of the most loudest and most unique sounds of jump scares I've ever seen. And his head just, you know, smacks down on the literal ground every single time you do a jump scare. I mean, that is just creepy. Let's head over to the next one, which is going to be Lime. Oh my god, my brother's using white. Let's head over here and do Lime. Lime is really similar to the shape of a hammer. And the jump scare is also similar to a hammer too. So for example, if we put it over here, imagine if this lantern was a nail and this would be the hammer. I mean, that's really similar to a hammer animation, right? When you're just smashing that nail into the piece of wood like that. <laughs> it's so sick. However, the main difference between lime and a hammer is definitely the teeth. I want to see if we get a really good cam if we just look under. Can we see all the teeth? Oh, wait, I almost got a really good cam. Wait, 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 wait. Let's do this. Oh, that was a great cam. That's the perspective of how uh, Lime would look like if he was killing the enemy. So I was in the perspective of the enemy. Obviously, the teeth is the main problem, especially if he just yanks his head down. That is definitely lethal. Let's head over and try out Teal. Teal is very similar to Mommy Long Legs, in my opinion. And oh my goodness, this is crazy. Look at the jump scare on this. The jump scare has so much range. I would not want to get close to this guy. I mean, even if you do get close to this guy, you probably get caught when you're so far away. Now let's go head on and check the other morph, which is Magenta. One of my favorite morphs in this concept morph game, this Rainbow Friend concept morph game. And over here, the reason I like Magenta so much, obviously, it moves around with wheels instead of legs, and the arms are extremely long. However, the cherry on top, the main reason why I enjoy this morph so much is because of the jump scare. His head splits in half and he just constantly bites down. I mean, that is just creepy, right? Your head splits, of, uh, splits in half and then in the middle, there is literal teeth. How does that even work? I mean, he has to be some kind of robot, right? To have wheels because no organism or no animal is able to just split their head in half, not losing any important organs when they do that. I mean, that's just crazy. And here is white. White is just really tall, which is also very similar to how black is. And white also has an alien-like sound. I mean, white is just crazy, crazy tall. Same with black. Black and white basically have the same character models. However, black, instead of having the flat part on top, it's actually the flat tarp on the bottom. Oh, I no, I can't get through. All right, that's fine. Let's head in the vents and end the video. Let's go over here, go inside the vents.